for half what you lost last night, if you have it now. Like as not, you'll get impaled on the morrow, and I'll see naught of it. Last time we went round there is when you got the dropping box. You're lucky as... <laughs> Could use a drink. <laughs> Bound to be some way I can get off to go see your son. Really need a bit of a release on this duty. Always the same, isn't it? March here, march there, win some at Bones. Go see the local woman crawl back, sleep in the mud, when the luck's in. Reminds me of Alan Chestre and old Nothelm. Mind you, if you had to pick a way to go, his was flaming wondrous. Moving right along. Ah! Uh, it's true. They also said to try eat. Uh. Well, I'll wager the real secret's something to do with myrrh. The priests are always going on about it when they talk of our lord. Surely it's a holy curative. <laughs> I heard there's... I heard there are great blood feasts where they kill nine of every animal they can find, including men. Savages. They have so many gods. It's a wonder they can keep track. I swear they had a new one every Sunday or something. Ooh. Jesus. Oh. Uh, sorry, Lord. Oh, behold, tis Boggy, the god of swamp gas. <laughs> I'd skewer the talking squirrel. Hey, it's squirrels. Now, about the, uh... First Ooh. it was the silver, then the books, and the holy relics worst of all. Our Lord can't even keep those safe. There was one reef. When they hit the good sisters just up at Kernerhead's farm, they didn't just carry off the nuns. They also knew exactly where to dig up the hidden plate and relics. Apparently the Franks had some success with towers. <laughs> if my eyes don't deceive, the BBB misses you dearly, brawler. Keep our spirit alive!